Hello and welcome back guys. Today I'm going to be showing you how to convert Cartesian to polar coordinates in Python. Why would you want to know how to do this? Well, maybe you're plotting something in polar coordinates, so you need to know how to do the conversion from Cartesian to polar coordinates in Python. So I'll be showing you how to do this today and I'll be using Jupyter Notebook. Check out the video description as I will try and leave written instructions there. So let's get started. I already have my notebook open and I've imported NumPy as NP. Now I'm going to create a function called cart2pole. And this is very similar to, or quite frankly, it is the same as the cart2pole function that MATLAB already has. Um, Python doesn't have one though, so we're just going to create one and our two inputs are going to be our x and y coordinates and and our polar coordinates are r and phi or phi so i'm just going to write those and r is defined in terms of the cartesian coordinates as the square root of x squared plus y squared. So I'm just going to use numpy square root function and then square my x and my y values. That's basically, that basically converts my x and y to an r coordinate. And phi or phi is defined as the arctan of y over x. So I'm going to be using the arctan2 function in NumPy to do this. So I've just zoomed in a bit so it's easier to see. And as you can see, I'm just using np.arctan2 of y over oops, of y over x or so y comma x. This basically just gives you the arctan of y over x. And then we're just going to return r and phi. So I'm just going to let r comma phi equals to the function essentially. So what this does is if I just had to write maybe a function of r plus phi, for example, this basically allows me to call this function. Um, in such, this basically allows me to call this function in terms of the variables r and phi. And now I can just freely use my variables r and phi in any functions that I wish to. And yeah, that's basically it, you guys. If you wanted to know how to convert Cartesian to polar coordinates in Python, this is the easiest way I know how. And if you know of another way, then leave a comment below and make sure to subscribe for more videos.